chaos erupts in the courtroom today as a Hartford man charged in the hit and run death of a three year old boy faced a judge. That boy was hit while running across an access road to a relative yesterday in Hartford's Pope Park. News 8's Tina Detail on the scene at Hartford Superior Court where the toddler's family members erupted in rage and grief. Even before this 19 year old was arraigned, emotions started to stir in the courtroom. So much so, it had to be cleared. You can hear the calls for justice in the gallery of the courtroom. The crowd quickly becomes unruly, and 19 year old Christian Borlees is escorted out. The camera in court is not allowed to turn to the gallery, but you can hear the commotion. That emotion spills outside Hartford Superior Court. After the courtroom is cleared, the mother of three year old Joseph Ortiz is inconsolable. My Police say Christian Bordelis was driving too fast through Pope Park in Hartford Thursday when little Joseph Ortiz ran out and was hit by the 1997 Buick Regal. His passenger got out to help, but Bordelis took off, and police say he later asked his girlfriend to report the car stolen. All right, you hit him, boom, and you stopped there. You stay there. Exactly. Don't you hit him and then you're going to try to ran him over and leave him under the car? You don't leave him under the car. You exactly. killed my son. There was an independent witness who was in the vehicle at the time it happened who said that the accident was unavoidable. Bordelis' attorney says his client ran because he was fearful of his life. He later turned himself into police. I did 15 years in prison and trust me, trust me, everywhere he go, he's going to get his ass busted. Bordelis is due back here in Hartford Superior Court next month. Now he will remain behind bars until that time because his attorney says even though his bond was reduced from $300,000 to $200,000, he cannot afford to post it. On the scene in Hartford, Tina Detell, News 8.